What's going on guys? T-Mart here and guess what? We're getting more Call of Duty Ghost DLC next week. Yes, that's crazy, man. Just last week, we had over 10 new pieces of DLC. You know, everything from personalization packs and four new camos and the Captain Price Legend pack and the four new character skins and the extra creative class slots, all that stuff. We had over 10 pieces of DLC last week. We're getting four more next week on March 4th. So uh, this is pretty crazy. Now last week, most of the uh, the piece of DLC were focused around like the good guys of the series. You know, we got four of the main heroes from the Ghost campaign. We also got Captain Price, which is arguably one of the most notable heroes of all time in Call of Duty history. And now we're gonna be focusing on the bad guys. All the DLC next week is focused around the bad people. There are four pieces. One is a legend pack, and then there are three other character skins you could download. Uh, I believe the price is gonna be the same, you know, three ninety for the legend pack and then uh, 199 for the character skins but um, anyway the first one we have here is the Zakayev character pack and hopefully most of you guys know who Zakayev is he is from quite a while ago he was the main antagonist or the main bad guy in Call of Duty 4 and this dude was a badass he was a Russian arms dealer ultra nationalist terrorist like he was just he was a very very bad dude and if you guys don't remember who exactly he was he's the dude that you shot the arm off of in the Gillies in the mist uh, you know single player mission and that thing that's one of the best single player missions I've ever played out of any game that was so much fun crawling through that grass when the tanks and soldiers were running by you and stuff I don't know hopefully you guys have played that mission because it's pretty sick let me know if you have but um yeah you got the Zach guy of character pack you're gonna be able to play as his skin in the multiplayer, which is kind of cool. Now, next up, we've got the Rourke character pack, and and you know most of you guys are gonna know about Rourke. Hopefully, you've played the single player of Call of Duty Ghosts because he's the main antagonist as well. He was once a member of the Ghosts, but he was uh, kind of like left behind slash dropped on uh, on an exfil on uh, one of the missions, and he turned into a really evil dude. And and you kind of fight against him throughout the whole game, and he may or may not have won in the end. You guys will have to play. I don't want to spoil anything, but uh, yeah, you can play as Rourke. Next up. Up. This is probably the one I'm most excited about. So I, I love the old bad guys, and I think it'll be cool to play as them. But I really, really like this one here. We've got the hazmat character pack. So you can get a yellow hazardous material suit, and you can run around in that thing, fight enemies in that thing. You can get your Breaking Bad Jesse Pinkman on, and, and you can just, you know, get it down. Get to cooking, baby. So, uh, I don't know. I, just, I think this is pretty cool. It's something a little bit more outlandish. I like fun stuff like that in Call of Duty. Like, I, I love taking it seriously, but I also like, you know, like the fun space cat camo or a fun suit like this. Like, I, I like being able to mix it up from time to time and make it a little bit less serious. So, uh, that is going to be pretty cool. I'm excited about that one. And then finally... Last but not least, this is the biggest pack of them all. We've got the Makarov Legend Pack. So, a good old Vladimir. Hopefully you guys know who he is. He was uh, Zakaev's protege. He was a secondary antagonist in Modern Warfare 2 and the main antagonist in, in Modern Warfare 3. And one of the most notable moments in Call of Duty history involving Makarov would definitely be the uh, the No Russian mission, where you had to go through the airport terminal and shoot everybody up. You were trying to do that to gain his trust, because you were trying to be like a mole and get on the inside of his whole operation. So, uh, yeah, that is, uh, that's Makarov. Hopefully you guys remember him. And this is a legend pack, so it's kind of like Price, to where not only do you get the character skin, but you also get a new weapon camo, a new reticle, a new player card, and a new background. So that's going to be pretty cool. And yeah, those are the four new packs coming to Call of Duty Ghosts uh, in the next, you know, couple of days. On March 4th is when it launches. Uh, again, you get the Zakayev character pack, the Rourke character pack, the Hazmat character pack, and then the Makarov Legend pack. So, uh, yeah, those are the four new pieces of DLC coming to Call of Duty Ghosts. I would have liked to see more camos and stuff. Like, camos are like my favorite things with DLC apart from maps and guns. But, but hey, you can play as some of the most notable bad guys in Call of Duty history uh, starting here in about a week. And that's definitely a good thing because I feel like I've been shooting Price way too much in multiplayer. Like, it breaks my heart to be shooting at Price because everybody's running around as Price. So now hopefully some people will start using some of these baddies and it can feel a little bit more natural when you're playing multiplayer. So anyway, there you guys have it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bunch of great videos coming soon. Check out one of the other two videos you haven't seen yet. Peace out, guys.